How was your first experience of international rugby with Ireland? Yeah, it was an unbelievable kind of experience, especially to uh, get my first cap over there and my, my parents uh, came over from New Zealand as well, so it was yeah, quite an emotional experience, but nonetheless it was, it was awesome, yeah. Um, you were one of eight Ulster players involved in the squad and the Ulster men performed very well. That would be very encouraging for the Ulster fans. Oh yeah, definitely. Obviously uh, a, lot of the, a lot of the boys got a lot of game time on tour and I'm sure uh, they're looking to bring that form uh, from South Africa back to here, putting on that jersey, yeah. And you finished last season very strongly for Ulster, um, which obviously resulted in your call up to the Ireland squad. How do you feel your game has improved in the last year or so? Yeah, definitely. Obviously, I've said previously I've been working really hard and keeping my head down and working hard with the coaches there. So, uh, uh, no, nah, yeah, we're just really looking to sort of taking my game to another level this year and really pushing on and uh, playing some good good rugby for Ulster. So you're back at Kingsta Kingspan Stadium again now. Uh, yeah. Are you looking forward to getting stuck into pre-season? Yeah, I'll tell you that at the end of the week. But, no, nah, yeah, I'm really, really excited. Eh? The boys have been putting in some... Uh, some hard work over the over the past four weeks, and uh, there's a lot of guys pushing for spots there. There's a lot of talent in the group, a few new faces coming in, so yeah, everyone's really, really fizzing here. Um, you mentioned there's obviously been a number of new faces added to the playing squad during yeah. the year. Um, it's Les Kiss's first full season in charge of the team as well, so are you optimistic about the season ahead? Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm really optimistic. You know, we played some some great footy last year. Obviously, we, we let one or two uh, games uh, go here and there where we should have uh, probably finished them off but uh, at the end of the day we've got a really exciting exciting squad here you know some class international players and some really good youngsters coming up so expecting to do some really uh, big things here. Yeah.